Hey Roses, back to do a flip through on this journal right here. Just finished this one a couple days ago and I wanted to go ahead and film the flip through while I had some downtime. Because as you guys can see, I'm in my room at my house, not my grandparents. Well, some of you may not know this bedding, but I'm sure some of you do. But, with that being said, let's just get into the flip through. Sorry, I'm trying to keep an eye on my computer because the net decided to wig out on me. Okay, this one was from the 29th of July to the 16th of August. So, and yes, I have some black pink stickers in here. This day was a decent day overall. Got to spend some of the day relaxing. Just kind of watching stuff in subfeed, listening to music, and looking at this long video someone made of all of Secret's performances. Also had my transplant appointment this day. There we go. I was trying to straighten it. After the appointment, we went by Barnes and Noble so that I could look around and see if they had any K-pop albums. And I was actually surprised by the amount that they had, to be honest, because it's still a fairly new thing over here in the states like as far as everybody knowing about it so you know to see actual albums is actually saying something so I ended up getting Blackpink's Kill This Love and Wendy's version of Red Velvet's The Red Festival I hope at some point I can go back soon so that I can attempt to find other members, but I may have to order those off, off of either like K-Town For You or Choice Music, something, but yeah. After... I was on the hunt originally for the Girls' Generation's All Night or Holiday album because it said online that, I, that they had had it but when I checked in stores they didn't have it so that might be one that I have to order which is annoying. mentioned that I have to have lab work done the following morning, which I was not looking forward to, but then who does look forward to being stuck for labs, you know? And then I had also went into a huge rant that I'm not going to get into. And the net is back on the laptop. Okay, good. Good to see. Because the net cuts in and out here. So here's Lisa's sticker and Jenny's sticker. And I love that Jenny's sticker was like the Laura Croft outfit. This day was pretty busy. I was able to spend some of the day relaxing at grandma's and I played a little bit of Smash Brothers to unlock some more characters and did a couple of like 
classic mode tournaments and the difficulty I had gotten up to high as like 6.7 which really surprised me because I didn't think that I would get up that high but because even like going against my brother he was always past 9.9 .9, so and today I wasn't too bad for the errands. We had post office, CVS, bank to cash check, cigarettes, so not too bad. This was also the usual grocery run as well. So it was also busy in that regard. And then I also did some stuff around the house to help my grandparents out, like Getting out their medicine, emptying the dishwasher, locking the doors, turning on the alarms on the doors, shutting the windows on the porch, things like that. So, did do that. This day was much more chilled out. Spent most of the day just kind of chilling out, watching more YouTube, and playing more Smash Bros. Also listened to both, like, all the way through the mini albums of Red Velvet and Blackpink, and I really liked both of them a lot. And my favorite songs off of the black pink album is probably I'm just gonna go ahead and flip the page. The um is probably don't know what to do and then the one off of Red Velvet's album is probably Milkshake and I feel like I'm in the minority with Milkshake. A lot of people like Sunny Side Up which you know I like Sunny Side Up but I just like Milkshake more. mentioned that I'd really like to learn how to use the tripod that a friend of the family got me, but I'm thinking about getting like one of them like selfie sticks, but then just unscrewing the piece where the phone goes in and putting it on the tripod and seeing if that'll work. Just is something different. was another chill day overall. Again, mostly just relaxed and listening to stuff in subfeed and listening to more music. More on the K-pop side than J-pop side. Also listening to some more mini albums and full albums. And then I also played games on pogo.com for a bit as well. I had also woken up with my back really hurting me and I did not know what the heck was up. Also helped out my grandparents by doing the same things that I listed before. Just because try to help them out where I can. Mentioned I was not looking forward to the following morning because that was when I had to have my labs done. I'm sorry, I had to get a sip of drink. And I don't like getting my blow work done now when. whenever I have to get it due to the fact that the person that has drawn my lab since I was two got moved up to a different floor and I never see him but he goes to a floor where there are much more harder people to stick so 
I get that his services are needed. I just anyway. Then this day was insanely busy. Spent some of the day when I could relax a bit, watch YouTube stuff. Also had lab work. It was a massive pain because the order that I had for my labs was expired and they had to call and get a new one and it was just a lot of freaking drama. And after I got through with lab work, as soon as I got home and ate and did meds, I washed dishes for grandma and then crashed for about five hours since I had to be up super early for labs and everything. Once I had woken up, I emptied the dishwasher, and then when Mama had gotten off of work, we did the grocery run and the post office run. So it was super busy in that regard. We didn't end up getting home until like a quarter to seven, which is kind of nuts. This was a pretty chilled out day overall. Spent most of the day relaxing at grandma's, watching more videos and stuff as a whole. Started a different let's play of the meals. Also, may mention I may start a Runaway Guys one if I can't find one of the meals that I want to watch. Mentioned I was able to relax a good bit because the week had been kind of chaotic with everything that was going on with my grandfather, which for those that don't know. He had his hip replaced. I know most of you guys know that. He broke the hip replacement. So now we're trying to find a surgeon that will redo the hip replacement. Yeah. This will be the fifth time on that hip. Mm-hmm. So yeah, needless to say, it is pretty chaotic at the moment. Each and I was glad to have a chill day back to back. This day cause things have just been super chaotic. did go get some sandwiches at Subway for me and my grandparents since grandma didn't feel like cooking. After supper I spent the rest of the night resting my back because I had woken up with a bad backache as per usual. So I just took it easy. And this day was quite chilled out overall. Just the usual watching of subfeed stuff, listening to K-pop, and then I also watched some of Masay's stream of Monster Hunter World. But I'm not the biggest fan of the Monster Hunter franchise, so that's why I didn't keep watching. My fiance did though, I just didn't. Today was another relaxed day overall. Just relaxed in bed and also watched YouTube again. Just the usual routine of that. 
I did get a shower and also went into the Dollar General near my house. Then, after we got through there, a friend of the family came by to take me to the pharmacy for Grandma and Papa. And then went into a different Dollar General to get some of the Ritz cheese crackers because the previous one didn't have any. And I also had found a Juicy Couture top and shorts, like PJ said, for $12.50. I was like, what? Like, you don't see that. Especially for a high-end brand like that. Unless it's like at TJ Maxx or if you're in Canada, Winners. But this was in just a Dollar General, which is like a more expensive Dollar Tree, so. So that definitely caught me off guard. This day was pretty busy overall. morning was kind of chaotic due to the fact that I had the female doctor that I always hate going to. Thankfully though it went well. Didn't really feel much during the internal exam is when they have to do the external that hurts really bad to me. Or not external. Where they shove their hand over there. After the appointment I was chilled out and actually dozed off for a couple hours. Then when I had woken up, I watched some more videos, and then when Mama had gotten off of work, we had the usual grocery run and errand run, so had the CVS run and also Papa's cigarettes. Once we got back to Grandma's, I spent the rest of the night just relaxing and trying to take it easy. So that's my back and also downstairs hurt for my appointment and everything so it's another chilled out day overall just usual routine I ended up taking another nap because I needed it. Then I emptied the dishwasher and did the next load. Because my grandmother had asked me to since she had to get Papa ready to get his license renewed, which, to be honest, I find kind of ridiculous because the man is 75 years old. He uses a walker. He can't walk anymore due to his hip being like it is with his hip replacement. We're just like, you don't need to get your license renewed because you can't drive. Then I mentioned something about like my auntie trying to get me to do a publisher's clearinghouse with her and I'm just like, no, I don't want to deal with publishers at all, especially since my grandmother had been trying for years to get something from them and they have yet to get anything. So she was trying to guilt trip me into it too, which irritated me. This was a very chilled out 
day overall. Spent most of the day. Excuse me. Spent most of the day just relaxing. Listening to more K pop and J pop. As well, as well as watching some of Blackpink's videos on their YouTube channel. Also watched some of Stevie DeMau's stream. A bit of Brooke stream too. So. The rest of the night was just spent relaxing and resting my back. Didn't have the usual grocery store and errands since Mama was exhausted after working. So we planned to go the next day. This day was chilled out and just relaxed and played some Breath of the Wild and listened to music. I actually had made it to the Zora area completely by accident in Breath of the Wild, which I find kind of funny because I was just walking around seeing where everything was. And then it's like, yep. You made it in Zora area. So. That was kind of funny to me. I mentioned that my back had been really giving me a hard time lately and I wasn't sure why. Figured it was probably from helping out Grandma and Papa more recently, and my back just doesn't like that. So, what are you gonna do? For the rest of this guys because there's only five more days for the rest of this I'm just gonna flip through it because my throat is really hurting I will mention this. There was a girl from the Netherlands that I traded one of the Jimin postcards that I had for Namjoon's postcard and it had come in this day so I was extremely happy about that. Uh, 
But yeah, that was the end of this flip through guys. Hopefully you all enjoyed and I will talk to you guys soon in another video another time. Bye Roses. Bye